Okay, so here we go with the endocrine system. We have two cats to choose from because uh, Missy and Tony, our cat, just does not have a uterus. Somehow, either it had a hysterectomy at a young age or <laughs> we cut it out. So we have no uterus on our cat. So we're going to buy our jerseys so you can see it. Hopefully, um, we'll be able to use Medix or somebody else's cat for that part. All right, first is the thyroid. The thyroid is up here at the neck and it surrounds the trach. It's these two little rinky dink things. I'm gonna get in close so you can see it. These two little things, it's on both sides of the trach. It goes underneath it, okay? Its purpose in life, it produces the thyroid hormone, all right? So the thyroid, hmm, hence produces the thyroid hormone. All right, adrenals. They are on top of the kidneys and we have to switch to the other cat. Excuse the filming, might get a little scary here for a second. And Tony, this is on our cat, and it is on top of the kidney. It's that little thing right there. I know you want to feel it, but there's the kidney right here. Where there's the kidney, and right on top of it, there's this little red knobby thing. That's the adrenals. And we're gonna go. I'm gonna let you look at it for just a second. All right. And its purpose in life is to produce. A, um, so it's supposed to be epinephrine. <laughs> can't read Miss. Can't read Melissa's handwriting. It's supposed to produce epinephrine and corticosteroids. Okay, so that's the purpose in life for the adrenals. All right. Now I'm gonna go back over to Miss to Melissa's cat. To the pancreas. To find the pancreas, it's on the back side of the intestines, and don't confuse it with the spleen. It's that dark strip right there. The pancreas and its purpose in life has two big purposes. The endocrine purpose is for the hormonal, produces insulin and glycogen. All right, the exocrine is um, it produces digestive enzymes. All right, so two purposes of the pancreas, but there it is, it lives underneath the um, intestines. All right, ovaries. This is where we don't have a, a, a cat that actually apparently had sex ever. All right, the ovaries are. This is the entire uterus. Those are the little, they're little tiny little things right there. And if you follow it down, where, yeah, Jersey, follow it down. Those are the uterine horns. And right there at the base of it is obviously the body of the uterus, okay? So the functions of all of those. The ovaries, the functions are obvious. It produces eggs, progesterone, and estrogen, all right? And the infundibulum is the only one that we haven't talked about and you can't see it, it catches the egg, so if he asks, it's just, uh, you can't see it. It's not something that's inside it. It catches the egg after it's been released from the ovaries. The uterine horn is that thing, this long piece right here, and its function is um, where the fetus attaches. So that's where all the little kitties will live. And then the body of the uterus down at the bottom, right there, is um, that pretty much connects the horns to the cervix. Look for the V for yeah, vagina. Yeah, the V for vagina. <laughs> All right, so that is the endocrine system that we are supposed to know.